Hey everybody and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you how you can fix uh, GTA V crashing on the loading screen. So basically um, I'm going to give you some more simple fixes to do and then I'm going to go on to more, uh, the more um, advanced fixes. Okay. First of all, make sure if you're, uh, you make sure first of all, you'll verify your game files. Basically what you do is go on to Epic Games Launcher. Okay. Whatever launcher you're using, and once you're over, once you open Epic Games Launcher, you're going to go onto Library. From Library, you're going to click on the three dots of GTA V, and then you're going to click on, uh, and then after that, you're going to click on Manage. And from Manage, you're going to click on Verify Files, and you're going to click on it, and it's going to verify your integrity of files. And if you have any any um, files that are not installed, it's going to reinstall. It's going to reinstall. Now we've done this. Make sure. And now we've done this. Another fix, fix you can do. Simple fix is make sure all your background apps are closed. Okay. Uh, you have an up. Uh, your uh, drivers are up to date. If you're Nvidia, uh, you have to download first of all your Nvidia and your AMD drivers. Okay. Uh, from their respective websites, and you need to make sure on Nvidia you have your your latest um, Nvidia drivers over here. If I actually go on to Nvidia and I go on to drivers and I click on check for update, as you can see, there is a driver that I do have to install. Okay. You need to make sure this is installed. Okay. Now, once you have this, is actually uh, once you have both of these things, one thing you need to do is the mo the advanced fix is actually going onto this PC. And from this PC, you're going to go on Windows C. From Windows C, you're going to go on to Windows. From Windows, you're going to navigate all the way to System 32. And from System 32, to, you're going to search for DIN input 8. Dot, okay. Input 8. Dot DLL. And you're going to search for these. Okay. Now, oh, when you now when you search for these, I'm going to okay. It's not DIN input. Well, just give me one sec. Okay, so it's DIN put. Okay, not input. Okay, my bad for this. It's DIN put uh, dot, uh, eight dot DLL, and you're going to search for that. Now those those two files, you need to copy them. Okay, you're going to click on copy, and you're going to paste it in your GTA files. How you can find your GTA files? You're going to click on GTA V. Okay, and you're going to click on properties. Uh, no, not properties. You're going to click on right click and open file location. From file location, as you can go over here, you're going to paste it over here. And once you paste it, uh, you're going to go on to play GTA V, not GTA 5. You're going to click on it, right, right click on it, and properties, compatibility, and make sure, as you can see over here, run this program uh, in compatibility mode for Windows 7 and disable full screen optimization and run this program as an administrator. And click on change settings for all users and do the same. Run. Okay, Windows 7, disable, run uh, this program as an administrator, and click on apply, okay, okay, and restart your computer, and uh, uh, launch up the game. If it works, uh, uh, no, it's not, if it works, uh, yeah, yeah, good luck, and uh, don't worry, just put a uh, like and subscribe on this video if it actually works. If it doesn't work, try disabling your antivirus. If it doesn't work, um, be, be sh make sure just to reinstall the game if it just doesn't work. But um, I can just surely guarantee if you do both of these fixes, it's going to work uh, perfectly fine. So yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you later.